how to enable USB tethering on the Samsung Galaxy S8 to the MacBook Pro with a uh, Mac OS Sierra so here you can see um, I'm going to uh, enable USB so you can use the internet through the mobile data available on this device here now on your MacBook you first going to need to install a driver so go to this website here it's called Hondis so joshuawise.com so I'm just going to zoom in so you can see the web address so there it is joshuawise.com and then for slash Hondis so go to that page you can just tap into Google Hondis and it will show us this link here and from here you want to uh, go and download the drivers Yeah, if you say click on this one here, say download the latest binary package. So I want to click on that, and I'm just gonna download the release eight package. It's gonna download. Okay. So I've installed this one already over here. So I'm just gonna remove it. Yes, I want to remove that. Okay. Once it's downloaded. You want to open up the download. Download it just down here. So you click on the download icon, the yellow down icon down there. And you want to open up the package. Now once you open up the package you will see that it say you are not allowed to install the apps because it is from an unidentified developers. So just click on OK. And you want to click on the apples icon at the top here. So on the top corner, click on the Apple icon and from the pop-up menu, select System Preferences then click on Security and Privacy then click on the Lock icon at the bottom down here so down here, there's a Lock icon, click on that then you need to print the Admin Password And from here, it shows there is apps allow apps downloaded from, and make sure the App Store and Identify Developers is selected. Then you can see here it shows the package name. So there it is. It shows the package name, Hondis Dash Release Eight dot P P K G. That's the package, and so it is being blocked. So click on Open anyway, and then click on Open and then click on the continue button to allow the installation to go ahead so click on continued and click on install then you need to print the admin password again so print your admin password and then click on the install software button so it is now installing Once the installation is finished, we need to restart the machine. If you don't restart the machine, it will not work. So we just wait for that to finish. So you need an internet connection uh, initially to download this package, or you can uh, copy it to a USB and uh, copy it over to your Mac OS to uh, install it. I'm just going to click on the close button and then you can keep the file if you want or you can move it to trash I'm just going to click on keep and then click on the close button at the top here now click on the apple icon at the top to restart your machine and choose restart right there and click on restart button over here and it's restarted right. You can turn off, off Wi-Fi and click on the network icon at the top here and click on Open Network Preferences right there. Now from here, so on your mobile phone or your Samsung Galaxy S8, we're going to uh, open it. So go back to your home screen. Swipe down from the top and tap on the settings icon. 
from here tap on connections then we want to uh, go down and tap on mobile hotspot and tethering then tap on USB tethering okay so share this device internet connections and immediately as soon as I turn on the switch you can see over here it shows Samsung Android right there as you can see and show the device is connected so from there you can uh, browse the internet if you wanted to or you can use any app that requires the internet connections so I'm just going to type in test do the test and there you go you can see I'm using USB tethering from the mobile phone and here it is I'm just going to click on that and you can see Wi-Fi is off and I'm still can use the internet and that's how you can uh, connect and look like it's pretty fast too so here it is I'm just going to click on that uh, it's pretty fast and that's it thanks for watching this video